Taylor Swift's motorcade leaves Indianapolis for Kansas City to support boyfriend Travis Kelsey's game at Arrowhead Stadium. On Monday, November 4, Taylor Swift's motorcade was seen leaving her hotel in Indianapolis. The convoy of four SUVs, three black and one white, was on its way to the airport for the trip to Kansas City to attend the Chiefs vs. Tampa Bay Buccaneers game. After wrapping up her final concert in Indianapolis on Sunday Taylor Swift will have 10 days off before bringing her new tour to Toronto on November 14. At this time Swift will have time to support boyfriend Travis Kelsey's games. On the final American show of her era's tour, Taylor Swift sent the crowd into a goodbye frenzy with two farewell mashups. Welcome to the acoustic set. Swift said in her tangerine and bubblegum pink dress before explaining how every acoustic set worked on the 149 show adventure that traveled across the globe. The wristbands on 69,000 audience members glowed bright blue in Lucas Oil Stadium. She blended Cornelia Street from Lover and the Bolter from the Tortured Poets Department on the guitar. The songs formed the final phrase, I don't want to lose you, I hope it never ends, but she was leaving, and it felt like freedom. On the piano, she fused death by a thousand cuts from Lover with the Great War from Midnight's. The latter song is what fans deemed the fight for tickets in an overcrowded Ticketmaster system. The echoes of the audience shouting the lyrics ricocheted off the packed arena's walls. Taylor Swift's recent era's tour stop in Indianapolis brought an unexpected romantic touch, with her boyfriend, NFL star Travis Kelsey, cheering her on from the crowd. Swift surprised fans by subtly acknowledging Kelsey during her performance with a unique mashup of her songs, This Love and The Prophecy, delighting fans and fueling speculation about her meaningful lyric changes. During her Saturday night performance, Swift switched up a key lyric in This Love, singing, These hands had to let it go free slash and it changed the prophecy. Originally, the line reads, And this love came back to me. But her choice to alter it resonated deeply with fans, who took it as a nod to her blossoming relationship with Kelsey. This poignant moment showcased a personal connection to her song, The Prophecy, from her latest album, The Tortured Poets Department, which touches on her search for love and the idea of destiny in relationships. Before diving into the mashup, Swift playfully asked the audience to wish her luck, a comment that fans believe referred to her romantic journey. Social media quickly lit up with excitement over the song's hidden message. Taylor singing the prophecy while Travis is there, because she's finally found her soulmate, wrote one fan. Another commented. She's so happy, it's beautiful to see. Swift's positive energy was evident throughout the show, especially with Kelsey watching alongside her mom, Andrea Swift. Observers noted her beaming smile as she closed out her performance, with one fan exclaiming, happiness looks great on her. After the concert, Kelsey and Swift were spotted holding hands as they exited Lucas Oil Stadium, sharing a rare public display of affection.